Lisa going. I love right? that old. That's, that's great. <laughs> All right, school hasn't even started yet, but high school football is already in its second week. And we've seen some great football already. Sports director Don Shane joins us now to look at tonight's Meyer High School Football Game of the Week. Don? Great games last week, some upsets as well. This week, the fans of Bloomfield Hills, Losser, and Ferndale got online, voted a lot, got 52% of the vote to win the seven on your sidelines Meyer game of the week. Our Brad Galley joins us live from Ferndale with a whole lot more on that game. Brad. Losser generally is very competitive within their own division, but after a rough couple of years, they're trying to get back to basics, and that means being more united and honest with one another off the field. And last night, honesty took center stage as each one of the players, one by one, went up to their moms and expressed to them how much they love their moms. You can see here, handing their mom a flower in exchange for the jersey. They took pictures with their mom. A really neat moment to watch these big strapping football players get down and bear it all and tell their mom how much they love them. Standing in front of everybody, saying my feelings to my mom, it's, it's, it's kind of nerve-wracking. But I really love my mom, and I don't think I could be here without her. I've been at all his games ever since he's been six years old and played flag football, and I love him so much. They're so great, and they're kind, and they're sweet, and they're, they're big, lovable guys, and I think every mom in there has been crying for an hour straight. You never think to talk about your mom like that in public, and I mean, it's kind of nice for a change. Yeah, I can attest there wasn't a dry eye in that room. And coming up at 6, we're going to hear from a Ferndale player that Losser will have their eyes on all night coming up live at 6. Reporting live from Ferndale, Brad Galley, Channel 7 Sports. All right, Brad, thank you so much. Those moms have been taking those little boys to games since they were like peewees, you know. <laughs> And now they're big-time high school players. We'll have more at 6 o'clock, guys. All right, Don, thanks. We're looking forward to it.